The city of Lushui is located in Nujiang, Yunnan Province, in Lisu Autonomous Prefecture. To its east lie the snowy Biluo Mountains, and to its west is Gaoligong Mountain. The New River runs north to south through a valley in this area known as the Land South of the Colorful Clouds. This area abounds with natural beauty, with its magnificent mountains and rivers. Sadly, however, it is also a deeply impoverished area of China. Flat land is scarce in the mountains and valleys. In 2014, the poverty rate in Nujiang Prefecture was as high as 56%, with half of its population making less than 2,300 yuan a year. Today, villages in Nujiang Prefecture are all connected with both highways and airports. This hidden paradise is no longer isolated from the world. In 2019, the poverty rate dropped to 10%. In September 2019, Pinduoduo formed ties with Lushui City. In the town of Laowuo, they established the Nujiang Lushui Citron Farming Poverty Alleviation Cooperative. The co-op took on university graduates returning to their hometowns to become farming leaders in the region. Shares in the co-op are evenly distributed between the 132 households in the village. With government guidance at all levels, Pinduoduo along with research teams in various fields are actively exploring novel poverty alleviation models, where farmers financially benefit and talented people are incentivized to stay in the countryside. At the co-op's flagship citrus planting base, intelligent drip irrigation equipment was used for the first time in the Nujiang Valley. A team led by Deng Xiuxin, an academician with the Chinese Academy of Engineering, worked with citrus specialists from the Yunnan Academy of Agricultural Sciences to select the late maturing Wu Gan Orange as the variety of citrus most suitable for growing in the Nujiang Valley. It was interplanted with citron, which has been cultivated locally for over 100 years, and the experts guided members of the co-op in day-to-day -day management and scientific growing methods. In 2020, Lu Shui received further support in digital farming. Academician Zhao Chunjiang of the Chinese Academy of Engineering led a team that tailor-made an integrated intelligent precision agriculture system for the citrus plantation. You can sow a field using your phone and spray pesticides with a drone. The citrus plantation here can be seen from afar. Villagers who are using antiquated farming methods just two years ago have now been transported into the future of modern agriculture. In just one year, the newly planted citrus saplings are already growing better than those planted in the last three years. As they enter their prime in three years, it is expected that 45 tons of oranges can be harvested per hectare, generating a net profit of over 150,000 yuan per hectare. There are other similar demonstration farms in operation, growing ginseng in Lanchang Lingxia, baby corn in Menghai, and walnuts in Wuding. The National Engineering Research Center for Information Technology in Agriculture built a smart agriculture platform together with Pintuoduo. The system integrates crop protection, agricultural IoT, freshness preservation for produce, source traceability, distributed AI, and other technologies to create an entire digitized industry supply chain from production all the way to sales. Through science and technology, we can improve the competitiveness of agricultural products from poor regions. In the future, both parties will continue to work together to promote smart agriculture systems and bring them to new areas to cultivate a new generation of talent in agricultural business, benefiting farmers with cutting-edge technology, alleviating poverty, and empowering rural vitalization. <laughs>